which I do have more yellow. So I am going to throw some more yellow in there. What's up guys? Welcome back to the Complicated Art Man channel. It's your boy, Al Fresco, AKA the Complicated Art Man. There it is right there. That says it, Complicated Art Man. All right guys, I'm doing a simple little quick video today. It's just how to wash a canvas. My flow acrylic white, I wanna keep this a little bit wet for a little bit. I am just throwing some white on here. This is gonna be substrate, background, for a piece I'm working on. So I'm gonna give it a quick color wash. Just this generic household paintbrush. And I'm gonna throw some color in here and I'm just gonna wash this out real quick. Believe it or not, this is gonna be the hardest part of this painting. Just setting it up. The whole key to this wash, I want it to be very ombre-ish and subliminal. So, kind of working a little bit fast here because I don't want these colors to dry up into the canvas. So basically, I've got some yellow, a couple different values of orange. back over this again with some white and wash it all out. Make it real dreamy like. And in the areas where it gets a little too dark for me, I'm just gonna come back over with some white and dull it all down, send it all back to the background. So I can already tell it got a little too orangey for what I want to do. And again, this video is pretty much just an instructional video, real quick on how to do a canvas wash. Always remember guys, the corners, tell them Sassy, go get them. The corners, and your edges are important. These things are very important to anybody interested in buying a painting. They want to break off that happy buck or two or three the edges and the corners. The borders I'm not worried about right now because that's going to be for last. So right off the bat, I do know I want more yellow, which I do have more yellow. So I'm going to throw some more yellow in there. So it got a little too orangey for me. Wasn't what I was looking for. So I'm just coming back over it with some white. And again, guys, this is just a simple wash. I think the most important thing about this exercise is to keep the brush moving. going to be the background for a piece I'm working on, so not looking for any perfection here, never ever going for perfection. We don't go for perfection here at the Complicated Art Man. Perfection is an illusion. I want to give a quick shout out to you guys for tuning in to the Complicated Art Man channel. Please check out my other videos and my blog on complicatedartman.com. And here's a word for you to drop in the comment section. Wiggly Dippy.
Loose hair, don't care. Pop it right off. And this is gonna be an action painting. Do some action, Pollock style drifting, and we're not here with black. Fresco's tip, keep it moving. Always keep your brush moving. Now keep in mind that you can do this canvas washing slash prepping on a table. Today I decided to do it right off of my easel and because I was beating the canvas to death, it was giving me a really hard time. That's it guys, voila, how to wash a canvas for a background for your masterpiece. Once again, thanks for tuning in to the Complicated Art Man channel. I am your boy Al Fresco, the Complicated Art Man. Have a fantastic day. Stay creative and keep on painting. Peace. Thanks for tuning in to the Complicated Art Man channel. Please check out my blog at complicatedartman.com slash blog. Wiggly Dippy.